Back here at home, temperatures today didn't get quite as warm as we were hoping. Joining us now with a little weather one on one as to why we didn't reach record high temps. Here's meteorologist Chris Michaels. Hey, Chris. Hey there, Jess. Yeah, today, today we definitely got a piece of humble pie. Us and every other meteorologist in this area, we kind of want to explain to you what went wrong. You deserve to know that, okay? So here's what happened. Earlier today, temperatures did get into the 60s in the NRV. That's where the forecast was correct. However, Roanoke, Lynchburg, south side, temperatures were only in the 50s. So why did that happen? If you've lived around here long enough, you've heard of the wedge, which kind of wedges in that cooler air. Also, a little bit of fog. As you see, this is from 11 in the morning, this satellite image here. And the thing about fog is that in the summer, it can dissipate a lot more easily, and that's kind of something we were expecting to happen earlier in the day because the sun in the summer is at a higher angle and can penetrate through the fog. But on December the 2nd, the sun's peak angle is 30 degrees above the surface, so it's not really able to penetrate through the fog. The fog could last longer, therefore temperatures didn't get quite as high as what we expected. We've written about this on WSLS.com, holding ourselves accountable and hoping that an error like this doesn't happen anytime soon. If you ever want something on Weather 101, shoot me a Facebook message at Chris Michaels, WSLS 10 News.